Hey YouTube, it is 7.58 in the morning guys, Eastern Standard Time on this wonderful Saturday morning. I'm Mag Sinker with Convertible Turtle, and that is the channel for myself and my wife Digrat. She's got her stream coming up tomorrow night guys at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And we're about to stream some Legend of Zelda Breakfast of the Wild. A hey, Monker, Pona's Ulti, Efren Garcia. How's it going, guys? Hi, David Diaz. Pleasure to have you in the chat today, guys. Sue Sodicum. Oh, way cool. <laughs> Curse Mark Gamer, good morning to you as well. Rainstorm Z. And guys, we got two levels of some snow boots to upgrade today. And then we're going to go right back to finding and hunting down those cool rock seeds that are eluding us so much today. All right. Hey, Jonathan Rodriguez, Shadow Lurker, Paya Pipe, and Dylan Blackburn. Aaron, good morning to all of you guys. And uh, I, uh, I have slept since yesterday's stream. I remember we were doing our snow boots. I don't remember what we need for them. Hey, Tamar Brown, good morning to you as well. And Nightbot there with that timely information. Um, we're going to port over to our ferry over. Oh, why not? We'll go to the one near Kakariko as soon as I remember where Kakariko is. Um, but yeah, uh, we have Monday Melee coming up also 8 p.m. this Monday. I need rush rooms. Dylan, you are amazing. Thank you for that. That's right. We need five rush rooms, I think, because we've got to have a total of 10. Logan Parada, hello. Welcome to the channel, man. We're going to we're gonna be porting right over to Gerudo and going and getting that. Hey, Jinx. Good morning to you. Uh, life's been pretty good, opponents. Life's been pretty good. I can't complain. Howdy, Catwater. Welcome to the chat as always, guys. Our, one of our mods, Catwater. Uh, you don't see nothing. Well, Logan, uh, you may need to refresh, man. Uh, maybe just that it was the loading screen. Tempted the final trial two times this morning. Died on the fifth floor and died on the fourth floor. Oh, man. That final trial is... Uh, it's rough. I mean, I, I really... I don't even know why I'm going toward this. We already discussed what I need. We need rush rooms. We, we need to go here. Oh. All right. Gl glad it's working, Logan. As you guys can tell, my mental faculties are in top-notch form today. We already knew what we needed to get, and we still try to go to the ferry. Uh, it's just been one of those kind of days. But uh, yeah, right now, guys, for Melee Monday, Cursed Marked Gamer is in the lead for a $50 total donation for this week. There's still today's stream, Sunday stream, Dig Rat stream, and Monday morning stream. So you got four more. Hey, Cuban guy, we'll be here, man. It's all good. Had more trouble with the middle trials in Master Mode than finals. I had, uh, my only death on the trials came from the middle trials. Uh, where are you? I am in Atlanta, Georgia. If you want to know where I'm at on the map, we are at the Gerudo Stable. We're getting some rush rooms. Um, you're out? Okay. See Robbie and Jeff Games. Take care. You still want to do... Th uh, that's cool. I, uh, I'm going to do that. Um, oh, Three Heart Master Mode running the trials. Oh, no. No, 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 no. I, I don't think that's going to be good at all. You've yet to attempt the trials. Well, you know, cost of entry doesn't cost you anything. And uh, all, all it will do is prove how good or bad you are at, at the game. Hi, Catwater. Oh, that's a good one for Catwater. I hadn't seen that one yet. Also in Atlanta, Georgia. That's cool, Shadow. That That is super cool, man. I get to drive on 285 West to head out to... My little neck of the woods in northwestern Georgia every morning. I get to travel 285 east in the evening. And I, I, uh... Everybody else can keep it. Wait. How many rush rooms did I need? Because I seem to think that I needed, like, far more than what I got. But 
all it'll do is kill you repeatedly. I don't know about that, Sue. Okay, well, have a good time, Tiger. Thanks for showing up, man. After a few days, you're back. I'm doing good, Raphael, and welcome back, sir. Oh, climbs, jumps off the rock before I can claim the prize. Oh, yeah, 55 mushrooms. Uh, not that one, Efren. We've already done that side quest. We have every side quest completed except for the ones in the castle, guys. Uh, we are getting mushrooms right now for armor upgrades. Uh, did you come here because, uh, a what? 5 or 15, okay. Well, we'll find out in just a second. We'll take a look, lady. Um... Okay, we need 15 total, so mm -hmm. we're going away. All right. All right. <laughs> Delivered a gift on the news feed for Breath of the Wild. Just two apples and a piece of meat. Oh, well, welcome back, Raphael. Well, I'm glad you're... It feels good to be back, man. Okay. I forgot about the news feed thing. I need to... I need to get the handy-dandy sticky pad out. And I need to write down Zelda news feed so I don't forget it this time. All right, and sticky note goes right there to remind me. That way I don't forget. I always write stuff down, guys. As funny as it is, right, they got that post-it note with that, that girl that's jumping and jumping and jumping. If you write stuff down, you are more inclined to keep it in mind. Hopefully something better at a later date. I would expect so. I mean, this game has proven that Nintendo can completely erase all doubt with a properly developed game as they've done in the past so there's a rush room right there all right boom now we'll go back to the ferry hey juliana how's it going 61 percent of this game and your data got lost oh efren that is that's that's horrible wow that's that's a lot of work uh, I don't know what my percentage is, but we'll find out when we kill Ganon. And it's looking like we're trending to take on Ganon in the first week of September at the very latest. Hey, Hugo and Zenan, how's it going? And girls get jealous. Uh, and B13 Tiger, see you, man. <laughs> now she'll talk to me. We'll power this up to the max. Not really the max, but almost the max. Mm -hmm. An Octorok eyeball, snow boots, and a rush room. Understood. Closing our eyes. And we'll see what this gets powered up to to require us next, guys. Oh, wow. Cuban guy, that's, that's impressive. What happens when I beat Ganon and see a 99% when we get that last one, Xanan? That's the goal, man, is to get as close to 100% as we can. And we're, we'll see what happens. 30% now? You feel like you catch up with other streamers? That's cool, Efren. Oh, uh, I'm drinking water. Cold, cold water. Alright, let's take a look, lady, to see what it's going to require. What blood money do you want this time? Nadra Skell... And 15 Swift Violets. Oh, wow. Uh, only at 55%. Hey, Creepy Miku and Sue. That's awesome, actually. Only at 55%, but you're on Master Mode. That's that's difficult. Take it that the best method for serious cork hunting is to do one area at a time. I would say that opponent's loyalty. Uh, why did she cough? Because she's in a pool mm -hmm. of water. Um, look like beer first? Oh, no. No beer. Beer is... I, I dislike beer. I've tried it like three times, four times in my life. Uh, 650 is quite a bit, Sue, but keep at it. You'll get it. Uh, do you do this fairy cubing guy? Because she she always coughs on this fairy. Uh, not all the fairies cough, though. Um, the other fairies don't cough. Yeah, that's what I thought. All right, let's see. Hey, Kitch Lady, welcome to the chat. All right, so we need Swift Violets, which we know are over here, if I recall correctly. 
What does the voice upgraded snow boots do? Um, I have no clue. I'm guessing it's just going to be an armor boost. Maybe some better speed. Beer is okay, but how about vodka or whiskey? Nah, man, I'm not a liquor person. Um, I'll drink some wine, and that's if it's paired with appropriate foods. Uh, I don't like to drink just to get drunk. Uh, I think that's just a, a waste of everything. Uh, money, time, and um, mental facilities, to be honest. All right, let's see here. We're going to go over to this button because we pushed the wrong one. Go to our album, to the Hyrule Compendium. Go to all of our nice foods. I believe these are sorted in really weird ways. Cool. All right. Swift Violet. Oh, we've... we've okay. So there's one over here. Awesome. We need 14 of those. And while we are roasting our pieces off, we need to go ahead and put on some cooler outfit. Probably do us a world of good to actually put on a piece of climbing gear to kind of help with it. Don't forget to drink every hour and stay hydrated. Yeah, that's a good way to go about it, man. It could be the sand that makes her cough. Uh, possibly opponent's loyalty. Um, she's the old fairy. Yeah. Oh, no problem at all, Hugo. I, For the most part, guys, I don't have any problem answering any of your guys' questions. Um, I'm pretty much an open book. Hey, cool, Matt. Welcome to the stream, man. You can buy Swift Violets at Zoro's Domain, and the cliff at the stable at the back exit of Kakariko has about six. All right. Well, that's extremely good for us. So we only need to, to first go out and buy um, the flowers, I think. So, Zoro's Domain, let's go buy those first, just to see where we're at with them, right? So we know exactly what kind of numbers we're looking at. Um, Hugo, actually, I'm, I'm very fond of red wines. Uh, white is not bad. Um, it just depends on what it is. Yeah, I mean, it really does. Upgrading the boots, Matt. Upgrading the boots. We just have level four to go. So we got a, a dragon part that we're going to have to be really precise on our shot. Thankfully, we got a phrenic bow to help with that. And uh, uh, the Koroks in the desert, correct? Yeah, there's Koroks everywhere, opponents. Have I ever tried mead? No, I've been told that I might like mead. Um, I, I've, but again, not much of an alcohol drinker. It's, it's just one of those things. I grew up with a, a family that are very big into the recreational beverages and I'm just not all right let's buy all you need 160 rupees so there's only four oh well all right so that puts us up to six. Oh, hey Agnesh how's it going man uh, let's see here well that's a good reason Cuban guy uh, being 13 would cause an issue there Hey, princess 1010 good morning to you under drinking age is a very good reason not to drink, and um, hard ciders are awesome. I, uh, you know, if it comes down to a, a beverage for alcoholic reasons, I have to admit that, like, wine coolers, I, I'm okay with those. You know, they're very low alcohol content, though. Nature scales are easy to get, just don't hit their head. Okay, that's, that's, that's good. Um, uh, probably the youngest? Actually, Yagnesh, we have some nine-year-olds that watch our channel. So, I would say no. But I'm not going to spoil who they are, but they have informed me that they're nine. I don't drink either. Don't like the taste or the sensation. I'm, I'm not really fond of the taste. Uh, alcohol is just not a, a pleasant taste in my opinion Good. 
So this is the this is the cliff, right? The cliff at the back of Kakariko Village. Oh no, Michael. We we don't do any kind of drug talk in here. Um, that'll that'll be enough of that, man. I can't remember what stable is called, but outside of Kakariko, and there is five or six. Oh, the one, the stable outside of Kakariko. Well, there's Dueling Peaks, and there's Wetland, and there's Riverside. So I'm guessing, oh yeah, Dueling Peaks, the waterfall right there. That's right. You wish it was nine, life was much simpler. Oh yeah, absolutely. Join the packs, 10. See, so there's another person that's younger. Do I play other games other than Zelda? Absolutely, Xanon. Um, this is a stream series, though. Um, only 9? See, Mr. Gamer 66 is 9. There's nothing wrong with being 9. Yeah, the Dueling Picks. Flamin' Gaming. Hey, Flamin' Gaming. Welcome to the chat, man. Alright, so we should have quite a bit of triggering happen off of this one. And since we're no longer in the desert for these, we can go to full climbing gear to get all of our benefits out of it. Have I played Splatoon 2? No, I have not. Welcome to the Total Club Flame of Gaming. Uh, Pedro Chavez. Hey, how's it going, man? Odd Doggo. Hey, how's it going? When's my birthday? The 29th, man. 29th. The day Mario Rabbits comes out. I, I might stream that on that day, as do I, Flamin' Gaming. Uh, Nintendo Switch game, or Gameplay Switch, 18? Cool. I remember being 18 a very long time ago. Uh, Wanna friend week? Um, well, you can do exclamation join, and that'll give you my public fra uh, friend code, man. Hey, yo, Red Fox. Hey, man, it's been a, a couple days, dude. Glad to see you here. And for those of you guys just joining the chat, there's 44 of you all in total today at the moment. Um, thanks, Pedro. Appreciate that. You'll donate on my birthday. That's cool. Uh, love them more than... Wait, what? Oh, a lot of people love doggos. I love doggos. <laughs> Blub blub, guys. We get to wish you happy B day. Yeah, yeah, probably. Uh, Zora armor. I don't think we need Zora armor because we need to get the swift violets off the walls. That's that's pretty much the the point of it. There's six of them here, if I recall correctly, and then we just gotta get these two more. Had a red ear slider. Oh wow, that's interesting. Uh, no reason to swim up the mountain because we're trying to get these flowers off of it. Um, that's got to be streaming delay. You got Breath of the Wild, but yesterday I got the Master Sword, Mifa's Grace. There, uh, Master Sword, man. When you get that fully powered up, that thing is overpowered. It is. It is beautiful. It is awesome. Um, that, that's that's just the best way to say it. Mario Rabbids? Yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to that game. It looks really good. Oh, that's okay, Red Fox. I, I figured that might have been it. I know a lot of our streaming... Uh, Zen Pang, you, there is the DLC that lets you do the Trial of the Master Sword. It's uh, It took me seven and a half hours to do it. It's 45 um, floors of funhouse awesomeness. Really challenging. They take you all the way back to... Basically, uh, not having anything and expect you to kill everything. Uh, that's just the best way to say it, is you got to MacGyver your way through the whole entire thing. That's cool. Um, I don't know, Yagnesh. I said I might. I, it's still one of those things that's so far away in my mind that I, I do not know. Uh, what is the goal here? Oh, Conan. So we are trying to upgrade our snow boots. And we need some swift violets and a scale. Just pulled out your tooth. Oh, Logan. Is that a, a young tooth or is that an adult tooth? Because that's it's going to be a different thing either way. Uh, you look like 24. Oh, no. <laughs> Thank you for that. I'll be turning 36. What was today's breakfast? Uh, more popcorn, guys. Uh, 
Digret's back, so she cooks me some real good food while I'm at work. And so when I get home, it's usually just a snack. Young tooth. All right. Well, that's cool, man. That's a tooth fairy thing then. New bot on Discord. What does he do? Um, which bot are we talking about? Does the bot have a name? I don't know what bot. Uh, oh, Clarence. Uh, that's what I'm working on, Matt. That'll that'll be there. Uh, while I'm working on them, I'm actually programming that bot. Why well, it's my birthday? My birthday is the 29th of August. Well, thank you, Cuban guy. Thank you. Uh, you, you can't tell because the camera and the, the green screen, but there's a lot of gray and white hairs. I have earned every single last one of them, so I'm not going to be getting rid of them. Yep, Clarence bot. Um, I'm actually taught myself Python over the last three weeks, and now I'm teaching myself the Discord API to put a bot in there. Hopefully, it'll help us... Uh, when Leo goes down. That's actually your birthday too? That's cool, Doodle King. That is super awesome. I, uh... Well, there's a rush room. Somewhere over here is a Swift Violet. Why is this called Breakfast of the Wild? Jacob, that's an excellent question. I work nights, and I work on the East Coast, and when I come home, I actually start streaming at the breakfast time for the East Coast. And since it's breakfast, we just call it Breakfast of the Wild. Sounds cool, sounds unique. Hubby's birthday is the 28th. That's awesome, Rainstorm Z. Finding new objective. I thought I just found the old objective. Why why you do this to me, game? Why does Nintendo troll me so hard? Glad to see someone is making progress. <laughs> oh, man. On their bot, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm making some progress. Come on, I know there's plenty of swift violets over here because we farmed them for quite a bit on the last time. What is Clarence bot in Discord? Uh, he's the bot that I'm programming, Yagnesh. Right now, he doesn't do anything. He's got. He is the bot that I actually been coding in Python what we've been talking about for the last five minutes, man. About to head off to bed, actually. All right. Well, appreciate that like there, Doodle. Uh, Pedro. Sorry for what? Internet slow. I keep fry. Oh, that's that's unfortunate, man. I. That's one of the reasons why we upload, though. We understand life happens. Stream is first time I ever watched you, and your channel's pretty good. Thanks, Flaming Gaming. I really appreciate that, man. I stream every morning at 8 a.m. Do you think more people sub when you stream or by watching your videos? Uh, analytics say while I stream. Uh, Lou, yeah, I remember, man. I, I said Lou Wop Jr. He said, just call me Lou. Uh, Python is a pretty lightweight programming language. It's pretty powerful, though, for considering the, the footprint it has. Very portable. Um, it's going to be running off of a Raspberry Pi. Uh, I don't actually have... It's Pi Zero. Oh, Omar, I'm doing good, man. I'm doing good. Thanks for asking. Just dropped in a like and sub. Can I ask what's going on? We are collecting swift violets, man, so we can upgrade our snow boots. We're toward the end of a 100% everything and its mother in the game. Oh, I appreciate that, Flaming Gaming. Um, that means we are getting everything. Not just what Nintendo thinks is 100%, but really everything that's possible in the game. Is it like latex? Um... I don't know, man. Uh, I'm not familiar with latex. Let's see here. Is Pi Zero the new one? Pi Zero is the really mini one. Um, it's really low footprint. Hi, Zachary. How's it going, man? Uh, it's actually like a. It's it's really cool. They they got. I'm doing fine. S13807. Thanks for dropping in, man. Did I, did I lose another one? I mean, is that what this is bowling out to, is I keep losing these? Seems to suggest it's still up here, so... Might be a UK coding language? It could be. Uh, adoption could be there. Uh, when you get Hungra? 
would get hungry. I'm not familiar with hungry either. That's the one thing about programming is there's so many languages out there. So many. Oh, hungry from all the climbing. Yeah, yeah, I would get hungry too. I would so need a granola bar. I'd be like, I, I need a Snickers or something. Yes, it will, Greg. Yes, it will. Uh, we don't allow uh, links, though. Is on Switch or Wii U? We are on the Switch with the Pro Controller. Helps to scan with stasis. Yeah, the thing is, though, right, is you can't scan with stasis while you're on the side of the mountain. Looks like this one's going to be over here somewhere. Man, these last little bits are going to... Oh, there they are, on the top of over here. Oh, my gosh. All right. Should I get a pro controller? That's actually uh, not something I can really honestly answer for you because it's really um, depending upon the person. Uh, Switch is great. Switch is super great. Don't have anything. Oh, that's a pretty good response there, Matt. Uh, there's four circle buttons top left next to sword and shield icon. It's Switch. If it. Oh, that's a good way to know, Pizza Ball. I did not know that. Picked up the Pi Top. It's one amazing setup for the Pi boards. Yes, it is. Pi Top is really good. Uh, Pi Cade's great. Um. I think that's a flower. Right there. Yep. I do prefer the Pro Controller. A lot of people pro prefer it. Ugh. How we manage not to splat, I don't know. I made a point to go to Zora's Domain as soon as possible so you could buy them often. Yeah. That, that's a smart idea. Um, opponents, we, we, we don't always adhere to smart ideas here at Convertible Turtle. Uh, join the pack. We are gathering swift violets so we can actually get us a upgrade for our snow boots. We need a, in total, 15 of these bad boys, which we just got. And we need a shard of Nadra Horn, which is going to be over here in the Lanrier region. At the Spring of Wisdom is the best place we can probably get it. What color switch do I have? I have a gray one. I, uh, the original Raspberry Pi Nintendo games pirated. Um, if you, yeah, man, those will be pirated. How close am I to 100%? No clue. I know if you look right there, we have quite a bit of Korok seeds to go. And that's going to be pretty much where we grade ourselves is the Korok seeds and the armor. Once we get that completed, we're, we're pretty sure at that point there's not really much we can do without the percentage counter. So now we're going to put on some snow boots and a headdress. Let's just grab these boots that we're, that we're upgrading anyways, right? How did you get the name Convertible Turtle Gaming? Well, um, long story-ish uh, is it's actually the... Oh, thanks, Lou. Appreciate it. Technically, everyone has a great switch. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, so, basically, 80% are made up from the Korok seeds. That's that's what I understand. Uh, P.I., not P.I.E. But, uh, so, the, the way it works is Convertible Turtle name, guys while back, I was actually working toward becoming a developer for Hasbro Magic the Gathering, and it was a career path that I was working toward game design, doing everything I could, and they had the great design search come up, and I actually did pretty good. I, I made it all the way up to round three. Um, but while they were doing this, they were doing a lot of design articles on their website, and one of them talked about an actual playtest card. It's actually called Calcitite Snapper. It's a turtle 
and it uh, surprisingly, and it's able to shift back and forth. And they called it convertible turtle because it was just a, a neat name. I thought it was a neat name, so I yoinked it. Um, but it's actually over time it's evolved to a, a totally different thing. And the Aztec had a a word for armadillo that was turtle rabbit. So a turtle that could become a rabbit and a rabbit that could become a turtle. And uh, <laughs> TS3B, yeah, <laughs> like that, kind of, but not pie, yeah. Uh, but so the convertible turtle name pretty much at this point now means armadillo as far as I'm concerned because it's just an awesome thing. All right, so... All right, cool, Lou. I will see you, man. Uh, what am I doing right now in the game? We are gathering uh, a, sh a, sh uh, a scale from Nadra. We just got to have Nadra show up over here because this is where Nadra kind of floats around. I know there's probably a better place to farm Nadra. I just don't know it. So, talk to the NPC again. Um, which NPC are we talking about? Oh, okay, that one. Oh, yeah, Cuban guy. Um, you talk to him again, and he gives you another quest. And you got to go and get him another thing. you got to give him another picture. Well, Princessa, I have, I have learned with cats, if they are trying to get your attention, you are best to give it to them. Because the way they actually behave, if they don't get proper attention, if they get upset, is they tend to make your place of living smell really bad. Head to the river north of you and wait until morning. So, like, right here, Matt? Like, uh, Varuda? Uh, go to Nadra East Gate um, and sit until fire. You're too close so Nadra won't spawn. Man, your promenade is better to farm Nadra. Okay. Where does he go? Because he disappeared from Gerudo. Um, he's actually still in Gerudo. There's a tent in front of the town, Cuban guy. He'll be there. But make sure I'm close to the river. Okay. I can absolutely work on getting close to the river. Uh, yep, you're right, because he jumped on the coffee table and meowed at me. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, cats are cats are like that. Cats are absolutely like that. Hey, Charlie Johansson. Welcome to the chat. Land you east gate. Um, you know, I think I remember doing that last time, too. Yeah, I think that's actually where you guys showed me th to get this at last time I had to do it. So let's just uh, do that. I think that might be better. Uh, Blood Moon, awesome, man. Awesome. I think that's what we had to do last time to get it. And so we're just going to do that. I think that's going to be better than the river because I'm, I'm not sure where its path is. And a lot of you guys are suggesting the promenade anyways, so I think that's that's just going to be the best for me. Oh yeah, Princessa. I, uh, I owned four cats um, before moving to Atlanta. And prior to that, I actually, when I was a younger um, child, I actually had a cat as well. Sit until fire. Yeah, sit till morning. Sounds good. I am I'm all for easy and slightly quick, so we can get back to Korok seed farming. Haven't farmed nature too much. Just spotted it there and decided to farm. That's not a bad idea either, Matt. You know, I mean, that's the one thing about having a community like this, guys. Is you all can collectively put your information together. That's okay, Hugo. We we totally understand work, man. We we got off of work before we came here to start playing. Hit. 
All right, so. Just kind of gliding blindly toward where we think this east gate is. And hopefully we'll find it. There's Lionel there as well. Oh, yeah, there is. There is Lionel there. I think it's a sword and shield Lionel, if I recall correctly. So tired. Well, blah. If you're tired, I recommend going to bed, man. I dare you to wear nothing for five minutes in Zelda. Uh, I did that. It's the beginning of the game. There's no reason for me to do that again. There is a shrine in Landry Promenade. Yeah, there is, but it's annoying. Um, it, it's this one right here. You got to traverse all this mountain, all this water, and all that. It's just easier just to glide off. I love the easy dares. The the ones that I've already done like 500 times. Those are so good. You, sir. Oh, you're mad. Hello. Goodbye. You should have landed on his back. You know, I wasn't thinking that. Oh, that's a great idea, though. That is an absolute great idea. Oh, Aaron with a $25 donation. Guys, hashtag Aaron in the chat. Really appreciate that, Aaron. That means Aaron is now in the second place running. And uh, call me Zelda one more time. Just subscribe. Welcome to the Turtle Club, man. A uh, new way to get more and see, uh, jumped over three fence like structure with a horse. No, I have not, but uh, Matt has told me about that one. And we just haven't got to the, air, the area that it's at yet. Where'd you say the snow boots guy was? He should be in the front of Gerudo City in the... There's like one of those shop tents, and he's just sitting down, staying cool. Um, well, Yagnesh, I, I don't know why. It gets a little muffled, I believe. We haven't been able to figure out what causes that yet, so... Thanks for another great week of streams. Oh, no problem at all, Aaron. You're getting hit less this time. Yes, I am absolutely getting hit less this time. I, I have... I've gotten down the pattern on these sword and shield ones pretty good. You there. With the running. Uh, we got hit that time, but that's because we weren't smart. We were using our bow when we should have been using our sword to get the dodge. Um, hello. Yeah, I got better, um, but I'm not perfect. I, I'm, I'm human. Contrary to popular belief, I, I am, I'm not a bot. Fire rods are great for Lionels in areas with grass. Uh, yeah, but it started raining, and I, I actually saw the, the rain coming. Oh, we are going to drop anything that we have for Lionel Bow, because, I mean... Lionel bows are just awesome. Uh, spiked Boko bow, absolutely dropping that. The the unfortunate thing, right, is we came here to set a fire to wait until morning, and we just we had the rain come. So, but look at the time, guys. Look at the time. 4:55 a.m. We should have Nadra coming pretty soon. Tinker Marlin, welcome to the Turtle Club. Still has a lot of hearts left. Yeah, I, I do. Um, it's one of the reasons why I love having fully upgraded hearts. Can't put a fire by the pillar. Uh, it's just going to get us to 5 a.m. though, so there's not really a need to do it. So, because you guys were saying about fire till morning, right? So it's it's morning. This is where the fire would get there. Yeah, 
dragon, 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 dragon. We promise we just want to shoot you once. And it won't be the same place we shot you at last time because we don't want to kill you. And we'll grab a phrenic bow because it's just good to have. <laughs> Tinker Marlene, I, I I agree, man. Um, I appreciate you watching. I have no problem with you guys watching at all. Uh, Dragon likes to ice me. Yeah, what's good? Earlyish game arrow farming spot. I don't know, flaming gaming. I uh, I do not farm. Um, I find it boring. I just rather go around killing stuff randomly and and buy stuff. Only got 32 arrows. Um, I have 18. I just buy them and save them and use them and buy them and save them and use them. So before 8.30, so I think I should uh, have some coming. Keep an eye on the sky by the mountaintop. So I'll be coming from the east, you guys are saying. Um... Okay. Well, that's unfortunate, Minecraft Master. Is it something I did? Or is it... Just find archer enemies and kill them first? Yeah. Uh, no need to build the fire, Yagnash. Because um, we can't end the rain. Um, that is where nature comes from. All right. It will come 5 to 6, I was told by others, though. Uh, 8.30 and before... Um, no offense, Yagnesh, but there, there's, he's going away. Okay. But yeah, no offense, Yagnesh. We're going to respect the other people in the stream first, and we're going to wait till eight thirty because that's what they informed me. And then if they're wrong, I'll set a fire. I mean, with the way time cycles through this, it's only going to lose us uh, maybe half a minute. It's not like it's going to lose all that much time. It's not 8.30, you meant 5.30. Okay. Well, that'll work then. So in that case, we'll just drop down here. And uh, try to build us a fire right over here. Hey, Charizard X, welcome back to the chat, man. Appreciate you being here. And yeah, it'll we can updraft, but we can't set a fire, really, Nintendo. And look at that, guys. The grass is burning around it. We are setting fire to everything but the pile of wood. Got to be under the arch. Okay. Have at you, fire. Have at you. Morning. Boom. Oh, that's okay, Charizard. Uh, Charizard, you are... Uh, okay, see me next year. Oh, wow, Minecraft Master. Uh, we will... Uh, that's right, you're going out of the country, right, Minecraft? If I remember right. What the world? Never seen what before. Um, sometimes it does appear... There's Nadra. Come on, you big, beautiful dragon. We promise this will only sting a little bit. Yeah, that's right. Japan, I remember you going out of the country. I couldn't remember... Um, it didn't happen right at first, but yeah. Um, so no Stalfus for breakfast? No, not this moment. Not being able to set the world on wood on fire. Yeah, it's really weird. Really weird, Chadley. Uh, make sure you watch where it falls, as it can fall in many places and is easy to lose. Yeah, we're gonna. We're probably not gonna give it many. Probably not gonna give it many places to fall. Because 
we're, we're using this sprint bow. Oh, shake loose, shake loose, Link. That'll work, guys. From the U.S., if some of you don't know, yeah. Uh, unfreezable clothes. Uh, I don't know if I have any of those. Huh. I probably do. I couldn't tell you what they are to save my life, though. Hey, Michael. Uh, see if you can fry up some Octorox. Uh, we're not really wanting to cook Octorox at the moment, man. Goodbye, Moblin. We really don't need you. All we needed was the scale. Rito set is unfreezable? Okay, well that's good to know. I, uh, you know, if I would have thought about it more than a couple seconds, um, I probably would have figured that out. What's my favorite champ ability? Uh, Flame and Game, and it's actually all four, man. Each, four, all four of the sets are, are super awesome. Uh, Sauce Pug! Hey, man! Love the name, by the way. It's pretty cool sounding. Uh, we are doing a 100% everything completion. Not a 100% Nintendo completion, but a 100% Nintendo everything in the whole entire world completion. Um, and right now, at the moment, we're about to upgrade our snow boots to level 4, and then start hunting down some Koroks. See you, Minecraft Master. We will see you in a year, man. We will still be streaming. And... Uh, just remind me, man, if, if I if my memory goes, because you know I'm getting older, I'll be close to 37 when you get back. Just let me know. Um, say, hey, I went to Japan. Came back. See you because you're going to the airport right now. All right. All right, man. Well, have a safe journey. Have a safe trip. <laughs> um, get as much of the cool culture as you can, man. I know you see this as a negative because you're not going to be able to see the chat anymore, but there's a lot of real cool stuff to do in Japan. All right, guys. So we have completely upgraded another piece of armor. So now it is time to get back to the travel medallion. Back to Korok Man, guys. Back to Korok Man. And we need a set of five seeds over five sets for a total of 25. Feel so bad for Link on the fourth upgrade. It's kind of like a spinning pile driver down in the middle of that hole, yeah. Uh, Nintendo's in Japan. Yeah, it's true, Princessa. That's very true. Absolutely. Hey, man, you'll be able to go to a Pokemon Center or 7. Um, so that's pretty awesome. I, you know... Master Sword ran on you? Hey, man, when, you, when your lightsaber goes dark, it's always a sad day. I, I, I can't disagree with that. Alright, so Matt was gone... We're going to do a real quick scan here. Actually, less than that, Yagnesh, until we get into the castle, because there's 26 in the castle. So we only need 874. How do I have the patience for this game, Dolphin? I have the patience for a lot of things, man. I, I was blessed in that I grew up in a very large family. I mean, very large family. Hey, Roblox, how's it going, man? Or Austin, rather. After you complete the final shrine in the castle, are you going to get the wild set? Yeah, uh, Dylan, everything means everything. I cannot stress that enough. Everything meaning everything meaning everything. Uh, blue pin, okay, let me let me delete that and change that out to blue. Uh, that was one of the ones I marked with uh, Eric. It was the purple pin on that map because um, it was one that they kept not saying anything about, but I felt like there was one there. Uh, yeah, the vending machines look fun in Japan. Vending machines look scary in Japan, too. Oh, Sauce Pug. The, the way I, I tell myself is that the fairies work off the same mechanic that the dye shop works on. They just drag you in the water and dye your clothes fairy colored. Like, with the water, you know. It's like a gigantic fairy brand washing machine. Instead of Whirlpool, it's fairy pool. Do you know you can search the broken carriages? No, I did not know that. Or I did not remember. Actually, I think I did that on the very first time I played the game. Let's go search this broken carriage and see what it's got. I bet you you're talking like... Oh, wait a second. Okay. 
Salzburg, welcome to the Turtle Club, man. Oh, we were way too close to that. Amber, that's cool. Usually it's Amber, that's good to know. Um, Zelda Raid. And we're getting raided, guys? Oh my gosh! Got a stand in it? Uh, yeah, we, we, we found it. Uh, Keaton, fear. Welcome to the Turtle Club, man. Oh, Sauce Pug. Oh, man, that's that's like one of the most common things. Direct Gorn Champion? <laughs> Thanks, man. Raiders, welcome. My name is Mag Synchro with Convertible Turtle Gaming. That's a stream channel of myself and my wife. Uh, Mr. Gamer 66. Uh, looks like we got another Zelda player out there. We are absolutely getting Raider. Uh, Raiders, welcome. Appreciate you guys being here today. We are doing some Korok farming as our superhero persona, Korok Man. And actually looks like uh, we need to get in proper dress attire if we're getting raided, guys. There's Korok Man in all his awesome Korok glory. And we are dodging the lightning. Why don't I use the thunder helmet to avoid the thunder? Oh, man, because the Korok helmet's important. Hey, Abasa Gerudo Champion, welcome to the channel. So we're heading toward blue, I'm going to guess. Oh, I hope it's not another one of those Magnesis puzzles like we had last time. That would, that would be so unfortunate. That thing was so rough. Missed the Korok in the water? I'm uh, not sure which Korok you're meaning, Pay a Pipe, but... Uh, we're, we're going to go after all the Koroks. We, we've got two very, and I do mean that, very um, cool guys, um, Eric and Matt, who are like my Tom Tom when it comes to Koroks. So let's find out where they hid this wonderful piece of metallic, well, I'm going to guess where the lightning just struck possibly, but maybe not. Well, there's a treasure chest. That could be confusing the lightning. It's got a big magnesis. Yep, absolutely. Huh. Alright, so we're going to switch over to the Zora armor real quick. Swim up here and take a look. Get that Cryonis out? Ah, oh, we don't need the Cryonis out. Not for what we're about to doing. Oh yeah, Mipha's Grace is our favorite thing in the world. Uh, righty. Korok hunting, yeah. Um, oh, that that's unfortunate, Zelda. That is, that's a lot of seeds. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That, that is, that's where we hope to be eventually. It's in the waterfall. All right, so we got lots of people saying waterfall. Okay, so we're oh oh I think I just saw it like chance upon it. Maybe not. Huh. Yeah, um, if you use the guide, it, 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 it absolutely can. Um, I, I'm, I'm still concerned that we're going to be missing some at some point. Either side of the waterfall, is there... Oh, is there like a... Is there a ledge up here? Oh, sneaky, sneaky Koroks. So we need to get up. And then come over here. Maybe not. 56 hours. Oh, wow. That's... It's easier to find it without a guide, to be honest. I don't know, man. I don't know. Oh, 
Wow, that, that's awesome, man. I, I, I can't speed run for garbage. Someone in chat suggested Cora Domain for arrow farming. 50 arrows? Oh, that's awesome. Oh, uh, yeah, we got a lot of really good, knowledgeable people in our chat. That's one thing I love about you guys. Armor that lets you climb in rain. Uh, that has definitely been the most number one recommended armor by a lot of people. Um, I I don't know. I, I think the, the rain serves its purpose. Oh, it's not in the waterfall, guys. It's the other side of the waterfall. Oh. I thought, I thought Matt was saying either side. I, I'm guessing that might have been on a correct, possibly. Got to go to Colorado Springs for a work trip. All right. Fly fishing, man. I'm not done fly fishing. I've done a lot of other types of fishing, though. Oh. No, please don't sink to the bottom. Well, if you, I guess if it sinks to the bottom, we can get it because we was able to get that chest. Played more than 210 hours. Oh, wow. It's so hard to find. Yeah. Um, that's that's pretty good, man. The, the problem is, is that you're going to wind up having a lot of time added from the sound of things. Okay. We need to drag this here. Set this down so we can fix our camera angle for a second. Stuck on 119 for ages. Oh, wow. Okay. Can we raise it high enough? Oh, that's all right. No problem at all on that. Um, hmm. So we're going to have to do this. All right. I, I'm going about this all wrong again. So we're going to have to go up and over. Nightbot? Yeah, Nightbot's a little bit on the slow side. It happens. Use Cryonis on the waterfall? Um, that would probably work, too. I just presume I could probably just take it up this mountain. Is it really a gotta though, guys? Do we really gotta use Cryonis in, on the waterfall? Because it's looking like we're really going to have to use Cryonis in the waterfall. Uh, I don't think I've glitched it out. Uh, we have to wait for a Blood Moon, I think, is what we have to do. Looking forward to checking out Digrat's video on Sunday. Yeah, man, there are a lot of people that are looking forward to that, Princessa. How long have I been doing this series? Since April. I've actually uh, been watching and playing since April, man. Alright, so we're going to have to go over here, climb up here, grab it, pull it over. Um, actually, we might already have it. Are we close enough? Nope. We're almost close enough. Not quite. The roots protection is now ready to roll. Uh, Digrat's my wife. Uh, this is a channel with two of us, actually, Zelda. 
Uh, it is myself, Mag Synchro, uh, and my wife, Digrat. And she streams Skyrim on Sunday starting this. Hey, we got it. We got it. So happy I'm going to the water park tomorrow? That's cool, Munker. No, oh, uh, I'll make it so that you can grab. Climb. Yeah, we don't really think that needs to be done, though. Um, all right, guys, we've got probably enough time for one more Korok, and I think this green pin is uh, another one. I think uh, yellow is our last Korok that we'll be able to get, because I believe someone else had told me about that one. Uh, Yagnesh, this is her channel link, man. Um... Uh, Yeah, Yagdish, man. You remember when I always start off my stream, man, with, Hey, I'm Mag Synchro with Convertible Turtle, which is the channel that's comprised of myself and my wife. Digrat, uh, she, she would be the wife. Hey, how did I get my channel name? Hey, Daniel, uh, a Magic the Gathering test card. It's how I got the channel name, uh, Convertible Turtle. And it sounded pretty cool. Oh, guys, public enemy number one. Public enemy number one. All right, let's see here. Little west of yellow. Um, west of yellow goes into the water. Oh wow! So it is. <laughs> Boom. Yeah, uh, get another seed and end. That's that's what we're about to do, man. Is we're about to end. All right. So guys, I think that takes care of the ones over here. Uh, by end game of seven days and fifteen minutes. Okay, well, that's good to know. Uh, I have an idea. Armor. Uh, um. Sauce Pug, we've talked about that a couple times already, man. And I'm, I'm on the nope side, dude. I, I think the rain's important to the game. <laughs> uh, get another seed, please, and end. Uh, Yagnesh, we're, we're ending, dude. 9 o'clock's 9 o'clock. Time waits for no one, guys. I, Nadib, Adele, we are ending the stream, guys. It is 9 o'clock. For those of you who are new to the channel and a little confused, should probably get the medallion before you start core hunting. Yes, ponies. Uh, I absolutely think you should do that as well. Um, but yeah, guys, I work nights. I get off the work um, shift that I work at 7 a.m., come home, get here about 7.30-ish, um, sometimes 8 o'clock. And then I go to bed um, at 9 o'clock. Um, was that a WoW reference? I, I don't know. Flaming Gaming? I'll try, man. I, I'll try, dude. Uh, time waits for no one. Absolutely. Uh, that's that's just a, a map reference. I don't know if it came. Yeah, it's not my day off. Now, tomorrow, guys. Tomorrow's my day off. And we all know what that means, right? All you guys are in here that are, are new, um, tomorrow night... I don't work, so we're going to actually extend the stream based upon the number of viewers, new subscribers we gain during tomorrow's stream, and likes on the video. So 9 o'clock, uh, so far we've gotten to 9.20 a.m., uh, which is just insane, or 11.20 a.m., which is just insane. Um, but yeah, I want to thank everybody who's been here today. Really super awesome. Uh, mad shout out for Aaron for the donation today. Really appreciate that, Aaron. Thank you on that. The raid from Zelda, that was super awesome. Um, and everybody else that came in today, uh, Catwater and Matt Rayford, our mods, rocking job today. Uh, Charizard X, Princess of 1010, Mr. Gamer 66, who came over with the raid as well. Michael Wester, always glad to see you, man. Paya Pip. Uh, Minecraft Master, who is going to be in Japan for a year. We will miss you. Thank you for watching. Uh, without you, Minecraft, we couldn't have gotten as far. Um, so you will be missed. Um, Aaron, um, again, I'm just reading the names out of the chat. Dear Slayer F Blah, welcome to the Turtle Club. And thanks for watching. We're ending the stream. Uh, Chadley, Ty the Dumb, Yagnesh, 
guys are just appreciate it um uh it's Ge uh, gezi yeah uh, we try to get as much good content out there as we can sorry i didn't comment on that earlier i must have missed it while we was enamored by the koroks um dogai with that hint on the unfreezable clothes thank you for that the flaming gaming who just joined and so we hope to see you later as well dylan blackbird uh, Penguiner 2GT. Always want to say penguins or something like that. Haven't figured out how to say that with rolling off the tongue. Lou Wop Jr. to identify Lou from any other Lou that might be out there. SKR8 Dolphin. And uh, with the patient's question, Rafael Rivera, Sauce Pug, still love the name. Austin Gaming, always glad to see you in here as well, man. Logan Parada. Opponent's loyalty. Uh, Septile Swag. I'm sorry, I didn't say hi to you earlier. I just got... It got passed by on the raid. Sorry about that. A Derek Goran Champion to come over with the raid. Munker. A Bossa Garuda Champion to come over with the raid as well. Tomorrow Brown. Uh, always a pleasant face to see there as well. And if I missed your name, guys, I'm sorry. This, this time of day, I'm usually tired. So I, I'm scrolling through the chat and trying to say goodbye to all you guys. I really am. Uh, sometimes I just wind up missing a name, and it just happens. I'm, I'm merely human. Uh, Rainstorm Z, Zen and Peng. Thanks for coming in as well, guys. Uh, we're, we're hoping that uh, Clarence Bot will help us out with this in the future. Uh, Rafael Rivera, who came in with some very helpful commands. Eric Peterson um, missed uh, missed a whole lot of farming stuff, man. That was mainly what you missed, dude. Uh, and yeah, Nadeb, Zachary, all you guys that are here. Really appreciate it all. Uh, tomorrow morning, guys, buffet stream. So don't forget, guys. Tell your friends. Um, tell everybody. You know, and the more people you get in the chat, the longer we'll be streaming. Um, there's still no actual cap on the length of a buffet stream but i think if we ever hit it up to noon we might have to call it at noon guys because i have to have sleep but yeah everybody man everybody uh, is loved and appreciated exactly what michael said thanks for coming in guys good night goodbye have a great day and i'll see you guys tomorrow for the breakfast buffet